bright and early on a Sunday morning and it happens to be July 5th. Does everybody remember what July 5th is? We got have Shark Week. <laughs> That's right. It's Kevin's birthday everybody. Shark Week. Happy birthday honey. <laughs> and it's just another day for him turning 29 yet again. <laughs> He's having his coffee. We got a text message at 7.42 um, saying that uh, they're dropping Mel off at the border at 9 a.m. instead of 11 a.m. So we had to jump out of bed and throw ourselves together. I tried to do my best. Um, I think I did pretty good. I, I, I just threw some makeup on and brushed my hair and tried to straighten it a little bit with just the blow dryer and throw in a, just a little white headband and we're on our way. Um, we're going to be a little late picking her up but um, we're going to get there. It may take her a little while to cross the border so I'm hoping uh, it's, we're not going to be too late in making her wait but we're on our way. Yay! I can't wait to see her. She sounds terrific and she looks pretty good in her videos so it looks like everything went well. How are you feeling this morning, Mr. <coughs> Birthday Boy? Tired. Yeah, you're on your first cup of coffee. So, give you a few more sips? <coughs> yeah. Or good. a few more cups? Good idea. <laughs> How come I can't see a picture? You gotta open the uh, lunch cup, it's bad. <laughs> I'm a little uh, out of it. <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> when we got home last night, we were so wound up still, we couldn't go right to sleep. We periscoped at like 2 a.m. in the morning. Just to see who would be up. <laughs> let's see who, let's see who. It was actually closer to three. It was like 2.45 or something. Yeah, Calic Badar. He lives in Australia, so he was on. It was only six. It was eight. yeah, it was like six o'clock or so, almost seven o'clock to him. So, <laughs> but he he got to wish Kevin a happy birthday. Yeah, first one. <laughs> but it's not such a nice day right now. It's kind of you know, but it's early. You know, we don't know. This could just be an early day. <laughs> we don't know what early days look like. <laughs> <clears throat> yes, we've become vampires. <laughs> How was the show? How was the show? Everything good. Um, she see a lot of male strippers in Mexico. Did uh, she put lots of dollars spend in? Spend a lot in, of dollars. Yeah. Oh my she, cash she, is she, gone. She give a good tips, you know, 100 tips for the male strippers, everything. <laughs> they, I bet you it all, yes. all was, the tips went to was you. really nice. <laughs> the, incis the incision recovered very, very fast. You know, it's the male stripper therapy. We do that in Mexico. <laughs> and it works really, really great for the patients. You know, I should be coming to Mexico for my surgery and for not sure, having it in sure. America. For sure. Actually, I, right now I'm training to be a stripper you know for the patients a hundred dollars is good it's good yeah. <laughs> well Thanks no so everything much, thank you so much and God bless. so obviously the surgery did not affect your voice no Woo you saw us and you yelled How is that? There there you guys. we are almost home already we have melody back there and uh, she's doing very well a um, little hard on the bumps so we're trying to take it easy Kevin is anyway, right babe? Trying. Trying. And uh No, he's making it like a freaking roller coaster back here. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you know, she's family. We gotta make things rough. <laughs> Can't always be nice to family. <laughs> I've been initiated. That's right. <laughs> So, yeah, we're almost home, about maybe five minutes from the house, and Melody is going to... What are you going to do today, Mel? You just had 
gastric sleeve surgery. What are you gonna do today? Going to Disneyland! Yay! <laughs> I'm actually just gonna walk around Disneyland, take the low, slow rides like in Fantasyland, like Peter Pan and stuff, and maybe some pirates or something, but it's good to walk. Right after his weight loss surgery, the best thing to do is walk. It'll walk off your gas in your stomach and etc. So, what a better way to do it but at Disneyland. I talked to one of the guys that works at the Mexican stores that we went shopping at. I told him how my son had cancer and he felt really bad. So he started just, come here, and just shoving things into my bag for free. <laughs> just a bunch of souvenirs I got to take home. Got a lot of good deals because he felt really bad, which was really cool. I don't, not into like cowboy boot stuff from Mexican, but I thought, you know what? It was free. I'll give it to Kevin for his birthday. So I don't know if it's a shot glass or a candle holder, but it's a Tijuana made in Mexico. Real leather on the front. I don't know if it's a shot glass. So there's his birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday. Very I'm not sure cool. what it is, but there's a glass in there. I don't know if it's a shot glass or if it's for a candle. Melody's getting ready to leave me. But we'll be seeing put each other. On my front seat, all of that in my front seat. This has got medicine and everything else in it. Okay, you hug her first. Oh. Okay. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Okay. Bye, honey. Bye. I love you. I love you too. Good luck with everything. Okay, so it's the end of another vlog. It's July 5th. It's uh, my birthday. Uh, it's been a long, long three days. We we're really, really, really tired. I am about to crash, but i got to get these two vlogs up. Hitting up yesterday's vlog as well as today's vlog. Um, I want to thank everybody for your happy birthday wishes. Uh, there's millions of them coming in. Um, I uh, want to thank... Uh, Megan and Brian, they uh, cooked me a real nice barbecue dinner. I was too lazy to vlog it, too tired. Uh, Val is sound asleep, so uh, I'm not going to bug her. Uh, I want to thank uh, my mom for coming by, doing a little shopping, buying me junk food. That's what I needed, junk food. And I uh, got the same thing from Megan and Brian. So I will see you all tomorrow. Don't forget to share this video. Give it a thumbs up and hopefully I'll get some sleep tonight and we'll be all fresh and happy tomorrow morning. So see y'all tomorrow.